So how did you first get involved in the fight game, Luke? Um, I started boxing properly um, when I was in the army. Um, I started training that and then ended up having a few bouts and after in the army before I left. Um, you've been quite uh, big on the own license scene on the day day shows. Uh, you've got a title, I believe. Uh, yeah, uh, middleweight novice title, yeah. And you're defending that too, are you? Uh, yeah, um, two weeks time fighting um, someone called Robert Barry for his title and my title. How are you feeling about that one? I'm nervous, like, but I definitely think I'll be the one. So. If anybody wanted to come along support you, how can they get tickets? Uh, they can get in touch with myself or Darren Tindale um, or yourself just to get in touch with some tickets. So, August, you're looking to get into the world of air uncle? Yeah. Have you thought, is it something you thought about for a while? or? Uh, it's something I've always wanted to do. Uh, I've always wanted to have a bare little boxing match. Um, I think now it's getting a lot bigger and that, and it's a lot more uh, like safer and stuff like that, and it's run like a proper sport. So I think, yeah. You're training hard for it? Yeah, uh, yeah, very hard, yeah. So you're fighting uh, Jay Eggleston. Uh, do you know much about Jay? I don't know loads about him. I know he's like ex experienced and stuff like that. I know he's um, got a lot of experience in like MMA, K1. And like boxing side of things as well. So, um, are you are you confident? Yeah, I'm very confident. Yeah. Any predictions? Yeah, I think I'll stop them in the first round early on. Well, that will be seen. Um, when you were talking about uh, your training before, training seems to be going well. You sparred a lot of rounds. Um, do you think it's a case of fitness will uh, it'll, it'll help a lot as well? Um. I think in the bare little thing, yeah, I think fitness is a thing, but I think like being strong as well at your weight, at, at your weight is probably a big thing as well. Like, yeah. In bare knuckle, so. What do your friends and family think yeah, uh, about your fighting bare knuckle? Uh, <laughs> I don't think they're the best in press, like sort of thing, but I don't think they understand that it's not like what it used to be, where you just stand in hay bales and like hugger each other. Like it's put a boxing now, put the rules, just you haven't got gloves here. Is that something uh, that attracted you to UBKB because of um, the levels of safety and yeah, the I think doctors probably, and things like that? Yeah, I think it's definitely probably the best run, um, Ben out of boxing, like association sort of thing out there, like just because of like everything down with drug tests and the doctors and stuff like that. Um, it's run like probably you will fight people the same way and like experiences you and stuff like that, so you're not just going to get chucked in with anyone. Is this something uh, you want to do, sort of, to build a legacy and make a name in, so to speak, or is it just like a one-off for you? I don't know. Like, I, I do. I've always wanted to do it, so I just think if I didn't try it, then I would, I would regret it if I never did. So I think I'm just going to go from there, really. But I do think it's something I'd probably be quite good at. Yeah. So. Um, the whole promotion itself, it's absolutely massive down at uh, Ola's Exhibition Centre in Manchester. How are you feeling about... Uh, Walking out, flames shooting in the air in front of two, two and a half thousand people. Uh, I am nervous about that because I've never boxed in front of thousands of people before. So, especially now doing it without any gloves on as well. Uh, yeah, I am like quite nervous. And, yeah, it's all good. If you uh, if you take the win over Jay, um, is it something that you want to? Would you think you'll have another bare knuckle fight? I'll have to speak to my girlfriend first, probably, and see if she'll let us do another one. But. Yeah, I think it's something I'd definitely want to do, and I think it's definitely something I'd want to keep doing. Um, I do think I'll be good, definitely quite good at it. So. I think your girlfriend will love it. What she, she may not expect is, once you're there, you get all the women in the nice dresses and all the ropes <laughs> and the suits, and you know, it's a real sort of event as well. So. Uh, she might like that, though. she might not like <laughs> She'll be at the foot, she'll be at the side of the ring, shall we? <laughs> Probably, I. Um, again, if uh, if anybody wants to get some tickets, can they get them from you? Uh, yeah, just give us a message on Facebook or message us on my number. I'll get in touch with yourself soon uh, and organise, pick, uh, pick them up and drop tickets off. Brilliant, thank you very much, mate. Best of luck.